Here are the most common mistakes to avoid when using a nailing gun. Mistake 1. Using a contact trigger for framing work. When using a contact trigger, the nail gun fires any time the trigger is held down and the nose is depressed against the surface. There is no safety, and the tool is very likely to fire accidentally. It is forbidden to use a contact trigger for framing work. It is only allowed for finishing work and for installing shingles. For framing work, you must use a dual-action contact trip command. When using the setting, the nose contact element and the trigger must be pressed one after the other to fire a nail. But unlike the contact trigger command, both steps must be repeated each time you want to fire a nail. Mistake 2. Bypassing the safety devices. You must never block safety devices or remove the nose contact element. Stop using the tool and put it aside when it isn't working properly, even if the problem doesn't prevent you from getting the job done. Mistake 3. Working too close to the nose contact element. A nail can go right through the workpiece and into your hand. To avoid an accidental puncture wound, always keep your hand at least 8 inches from the nailing gun. When working on the floor, start with the lower nail, then remove the hand supporting the workpiece and fire the top nail. Mistake 4. Overreaching or working in an unstable position. When the angle is too steep, the nails can ricochet and hurt someone. That's why you need to hold the tool at the right angle to the work surface. Mistake 5. Firing when someone is in line with the nailing gun. We can't predict when the nail will accidentally fire or ricochet. You need to always be aware of the other people in your work area. Never point the tool towards yourself or towards someone else. Mistake 6. Working without safety glasses. You aren't only at risk of being struck by flying debris when using a saw. You need to always wear safety glasses when using a nailing gun. Mistake 7. Carrying the tool with your finger on the trigger. When your finger is on the trigger, a simple bump of the nose will eject a nail. You must always take your finger off the trigger when moving around to avoid accidentally firing a nail. Mistake 8. Pulling on the air hose to pick up the nailing gun. The nailing gun can be directed at you or someone else. Always pick it up by the handle. If you need to put down the nailing gun momentarily, place the nose towards a wall in case the tool accidentally fires. Mistake 9. Leaving the nailing gun plugged in unnecessarily. You increase the risk of an accidental firing and of injury by leaving it plugged in. When not in use, unplug the air hose. You also need to unplug the hose when carrying the nailing gun, passing it to someone else, or when removing a jam nail. Mistake 10. Not respecting safety measures when the magazine is empty. You could be wrong. There could be a nail left or someone may have loaded the nailing gun. That's why you always handle the nailing gun as if it is loaded, even if you think it's empty. Obviously, a nailing gun is made for nailing, but you need to use the right model for the right job and know how to use it properly.